KSC1500 is the world's first sound isolating electrostatic earphone system. It's capable of producing the broadest frequency range with the fastest transient response, which really translates into one of the most immersive audio experiences available. Portability is really a key factor here. Um, electrostatic technology has really not been a portable solution at, up to this point. We're able to take and shrink down something that is typically a very large panel. So for instance, electrostatic speakers are very usually very large panel speakers. And shrink that down to something that's roughly the size of a dime to fit it into an earphone. One of the key features that makes the KSC 1500 amplifier great is its ability to convert digital audio to analog audio using a high-resolution 24-bit, 96 kilohertz sampling rate. Describing the sound of KSC 1500 is a little bit difficult because it doesn't sound like anything else. It's an all-encompassing, immersive experience. Take the speed and the brilliance and the broad response of an electrostatic transducer and combine it with the benefits of isolation. And you have an experience like no other. It's incredibly high fidelity. You hear exactly what is in your source file like nothing else. An electrostatic transducer works by applying a static charge directly to the diaphragm. The diaphragm is then placed between two metal plates which you apply the audio signal. The application of the audio signal modulates that electrostatic field which causes the diaphragm to displace. When the diaphragm displaces you move air and therefore when you move air you create sound. One of the great things about the electrostatic driver in the KSC 1500 earphones is that the diaphragm itself is nearly massless. The speed of that diaphragm moving and the, and the ease that it moves allows that single driver to recreate a full range of frequencies, audible frequencies, uh, with such ease and such a great fast transient response that the correlation to the sound coming out the nozzle is almost exactly perfectly matched to the electrical audio signal that's coming into the transducer to start. The cable in the KSE 1500 is by itself an engineering masterpiece. We had to design specifically a very special cable with low capacitance, um, yet also satisfies all of the, the requirements for uh, our, our typical earphone in terms of strength and um, flex and um, all the other types of electrical parameters we would need the cable to satisfy. As we got deeper in development, the topic of EQ came up, and we spent a lot of time discussing whether or not we should include an EQ or what type of EQ we should include in the product. We wanted our EQ function to uh, not be limited, so we created a four-band parametric EQ, allowing the user to customize which frequency they want to adjust, so they can fully customize their own sound the way they want it. The sound coming out of the KSC 1500 earphones is the most natural experience I've heard out of an earphone to date. Uh, the transparency is there, all the clarity and detail that you could possibly ask for. That combined with the fact that you have the capability to customize via the DSP and the EQ, it makes it anything you want it to be. And the capability is, is surpassing anything else I've heard. I am infinitely proud of the team of people it took to make this product. Uh, we could have quit at any given time for any reason. We had a lot of reasons to give up on this and only one reason to keep going and that was we knew that what we were making was the best thing. So I'm proud of us that we stuck our necks out there and took a risk and tried to make something that no one else in the world had done before. The early results were so promising that we wondered early on if we would actually bring it across the finish line. So I'm terribly proud that we, we were able to do that. And I think it'll go down for one of the biggest accomplishments in, in Shure's history.